trust I'm honest when they're telling lies. Can you see what I'm not saying through my eyes? All I know is love. All right, you guys. So we're about to do a quick Walmart haul. No order. I'm just going to pull stuff out the bag and show you what I got. I got this two pound box of panko butterfly shrimp. A big Marie Callender's beef pot pie. A chicken pot pie. Two bags of broccoli florets. A lemon. A bag of frozen onions and peppers. A bottle of club soda. I needed this because I'm doing a tempura batter. And I use this inside my tempura batter. I'm doing um, some vegan wings made out of cauliflower. And I need some club soda. Two boxes of penne pasta. Some cubed Kobe Monterey Jack cheese. A bag of Mexican flavored Velveeta cheese. Some lightly salted um, almonds. Like I've been obsessed with almonds lately. These are so good. These and the honey roasted almonds, bomb. I got a ton of foil pans. I have an event coming up and I needed a bunch of pans, so. A chicken pot pie. Ronnie loves these pot pies. So if I'm like busy cooking for work and I don't got time to cook or whatever, he'll just throw one of these in the oven. A bag of chopped spinach. A bag of three color pepper and onion strips. Um, I'm doing a vegan tofu stir fry noodles. And I need these pepper strips. And um, these sugar snap pre uh, pre's. These sugar snap peas stir fry for my um, stir fry noodles. Okay, I of course can cut my own noodles, but this is a time saver. And some of them. Sometimes these are good depending on what you're cooking, so I got that. I have a California style veggie mix, a bag of mixed vegetables, two cans of tomato paste. I gotta make a pan of arroz con gandules and a pan of seafood rice, so I needed some tomato paste. I got a can of calamari and garlic sauce to go inside my seafood rice. I got some lo mein noodles for my um, veggie stir fry noodles, teriyaki sauce for my veggie stir fry noodles, some sesame seeds for my veggie stir fry noodles. I got some barbecue sauce. I got another can of lightly salted almonds. Y'all, I've been obsessed. And the uh, honey roasted almonds, so good. A pack of lemon pepper wing mix for my um, vegan wings that I'm gonna make. Some half and half. I gotta make um, a millionaire's mac and cheese. Needed that. Some ricotta cheese for a veggie lasagna. You guys, my event, they don't eat meat. So everything is either vegetarian, vegan, or pescatarian. So their whole menu doesn't have meat. It's all seafood or just veggies. Okay, so I needed some ricotta cheese for a veggie lasagna. Some more um, shredded cheese. I got some Italian blend. Okay, two bags of cheddar Velveeta. Some more Italian blend. Original Velveeta. Some more Italian blend. I got two big bottles of canola oil. This is what I like to fry in. They ordered... Um, some veggie empanadas some cheesy veggie empanadas and the vegan wings i need the oil to fry both of them and also they ordered a shrimp parmesan so i gotta fry the shrimp got a small little bag of filet hot cheetos two boxes of elbow macaroni noodles for the millionaire mac and cheese a box of oven ready lasagna for the veggie lasagna a Suja Immunity Rebound Shot. I just like to just drink these. These are like pretty intense, so you just gotta throw them back, but they're good. A big crown of broccoli. This is for, I guess, the veggie lasagna. All right, so I got that. I got some sliced white mushrooms. This is gonna be for the stir fry noodles and for the veggie lasagna. I got a beautiful piece of salmon. They ordered a salmon Alfredo, and I needed some salmon for that. You guys, look at how beautiful this piece of salmon is. Okay, gorgeous. 
I got a bag of wild caught pink salmon fillets. This is gonna be for the inside of the salmon alfredo. And then I sear, well I sear it all. I put this kind of salmon inside since it's gonna be like engulfed in sauce. And then I put this salmon on the top um, for like the gar garnish and just for like the whole visual. All right, so I got that. I got a bag of seafood mix for the um, seafood, yellow rice. All right, this has all kind of stuff in it. It's gonna be good. I got some shrimp for the seafood, yellow rice. I buy cooked shrimp for the seafood, yellow rice because that helps me control the size of the shrimp. And also you can't really boil um, shrimp long inside the rice and you can't really stir the rice too much so for me it's easier for me to like lightly saute the shrimp warm them up and then stir it into the rice okay the other seafood that goes in the seafood rice is front is fine but the shrimp i don't really want them to be tough so these are already cooked i just season them saute them and then stir them in all right so i got that i got some more cheese some mozzarella extra sharp cheddar Colby Jack, another mozzarella. I got some firm tofu to go inside the veggie stir fry noodles. All right, this table is getting super crowded. Let me uh, move some of this stuff over. I got some milk, some cilantro, a can of Febreze with a downy in it. A packet of Taco Bell taco seasoning mix. This is going to be for my vegetarian empanadas. Some corn, peas and carrots, chopped spinach, chopped diced onions, two bacon potatoes, two big heads of cabbage. Somebody ordered a pan of some um, vegetarian cabbage for me. So instead of putting like sausages and stuff in it, I'm going to put like some shredded carrots. Um, onions and peppers and different spices like I'm gonna hook it up I'm gonna make it taste good even though it doesn't have any meat in it so I got two big heads of cabbage right here here is the shredded well I do the matchstick carrots because the shredded ones they just totally disintegrate in the pot so I got a bag of the matchstick carrots I got a bag of frozen um, red yellow green peppers and onions I do, of course, sometimes buy a whole bunch and then cut and freeze my own. But sometimes, like, yeah, the last thing I'm going to do is chop up some onions and peppers. But I love to cook with them. So I just buy bags of these and they taste just the same pretty much. Depending on how you cook them and what you're cooking them in, they taste the same. Sometimes if you put them in certain things, they'll be, like, a little bit mushy. But for what I need them for, these are just fine. Okay, so I got, um... A bag of, of this yeah I got seven heads of cauliflower someone ordered um, two pans of vegan wings for me and I make mine out of cauliflower like I, I cut them a certain way then I batter them fry them and then sauce them maybe I'll do a video of me making them but anyway I hope this is gonna be enough but um this is a good start I got seven heads right here Okay, good. So I got another big head of cabbage. I have to do a really big pot of um, vegan cabbage. All right, so I got three instead of two. I got a bag of meow mix for my cat, for Smokey. He likes the tender center ones. Um, these are pretty much like a big bag of treats to me. I don't know, but he likes them. This is the chicken and tuna. All right. And then for Brooklyn, I got her a box of these pedigree pouches. Um, this box has 18 pouches. I mixed this with her hard food. She's still on puppy food. So I mixed like half a pouch of this with like a cup of dry food. And this is what I give her. And the pouches are just more convenient because I could just close them back or fold them over. Because, um, yeah, whatever. So this has three different varieties with six of each and these are the ones in gravy why not man i'm coming for that number